If you serve her gluten, you'll have her tootin'. Host of Kennedy Saves the World podcast, Kennedy. He's thinner than the plot to Fast and Furious 9. New York Times bestselling author and Fox News contributor, Cat Tim. I don't get it. And Kennedy, you're a female. What? Yes. <laughs> I know. It's true. And you're, you know, you're sad. You're You have daughters, I'm I I'm not going to touch you where your bathing suit covers. <laughs> yes. My point is oh. you were... To your point, it's so expensive to go to movies anymore. Why would you waste your time and money seeing this when the dialogue is completely predictable and you don't care about the character? Mm-hmm. That's so true. You know, Tyler... I think that she probably wouldn't be that nice to me. No, she wouldn't. But if I stopped being nice to people just because they would hate me or did hate me, a lot of my relationships would have been a lot shorter. <laughs> <laughs> and they want her to apologize the next day on TV or never work again because you made a joke that someone might not like. Has ever wanted the woke story. We've been tricked into thinking they have. should make a woke version of Dirty Hair. Tyler, so what's the deal here? What's going on? Don't be on again. I'll, I'll take care of him, boss. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it must be bad if my... Encampments everywhere. But when the money comes, let's be honest, that's what this is. Right. About this cat last week. I think it was last week. And we... yeah, the, the charcoal masks, I remember them well, the peel-off ones. Yes. The Biore masks would clear your pores, but actually make your large pores even worse. Um, so maybe that's what he's doing. Maybe he's got a nice charcoal mask. He, he's trying to tame his adolescent skin. I, I, really, I really feel for him because we've been in that position. I was in that position a couple hours ago. Uh, I was listening to Brett Bear's book, and I, I was wearing mascara, and I was so moved that I just, I sobbed my mascara down my face and got called into HR. Yes. <laughs> so I've been through something very similar. Uh, Guys, wait for me. And they all walked out there. Tucker and Kid Rock, right? Yeah, yeah. So, so Tyler, I have this theory uh, that explains, like, the vote. Exactly. You're my no, Trump. I know. No. I'm sorry. I literally never thought I would say this in my whole life, ever, but I know exactly how Donald Trump feels. Yeah. <laughs> I know what it's like to have someone's wife making it very clear that they do not like me. <laughs> and the guy just sits there and lets her keep doing it, even though I'm just <laughs> standing there. <laughs> Minding but, my business. But you know what it is? She was a nasty woman, right? She's a nasty woman. <laughs> right, nasty woman. She was so nasty, right? But we'll be back. We'll be back, and I'll show her the bird, the bald eagle, because I'll be back in the White House. <laughs> How about that freedom, right? That's freedom, right? 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 Uh, be careful. Greg's going to keep you. Greg's going to keep you and put you in a cage, and when his friends come over, do it. Do the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do the thing. I, I really Eric Swalwell was coming up the escalator at Newark Airport. I was going down, and I was like, hey, Swalwell. And he looked up, and I, I gave him the double bird. Yeah. You know, because it's like Eric Fartwell has, you know, he, he's not doing anyone any favors in Congress. Yeah. We think that he was making body Congress with a Chinese spy. Mm -hmm. She's it, dead now. I, I Too soon. Okay, I'm <laughs> okay, oh, sorry. <laughs> that was the intro to the iconic 70s show, The Odd Couple. I had no idea today was Felix Unger Day. I, see, I was one of those people. I thought that they were a, a nice gay couple who were just temperamentally mismatched. Oh. So. <laughs> that didn't exist back then, by the way. Gay Does, didn't come out to like. Did 75. Felix reconcile with his wife? <laughs> no. Oh. That's the other. Well, I'm glad that I came in today because now I know what the show's about. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not like something crazy now. I mean, in New York, grown men live together all the time. Yeah. Because it's expensive. Tyler <laughs> yeah. Fisher, Captain Tyrus.